Hey guys, we're here with Phil at the G-Shock store. First cab off the rank. How are you, mate? Good, mate. Nice to meet you. So, a couple of questions here. Um, can you just give us a bit of a background on what the company is about and where you come from? Well, G-Shock started in 1983 um, as a a brand built for absolute toughness. Um, our inventor or father of G-Shock, uh, eBay-san, had a very special watch to him that unfortunately broke and he decided from that point on he wanted to make a watch that lasted forever and was absolutely tough. So 35 years later we've sold 100 million watches um, and it seems like everyone likes the toughness of our watches. Well, it certainly seems to be the emphasis of most of the stuff that's here. People have equipment, it breaks, and they want something better. Do you have any products that you're launching here today? Um, we're showcasing our new um, GPS rangement. So um, this one is a full uh, solar GPS watch, so um, satellite GPS. It's Again, it's got all the G-Shock functions of being absolutely tough, but now just connected to... Uh, to the satellite so it can help you find your way out of a tough situation. Now, I did see the video on this on the uh, on the AWE page and it is a phenomenal watch. Uh, you can e even charge it w with a cord and all that sort of stuff as well so it just gives you that other option there so that's really fantastic. Bit out of my price range. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do you have in the pipeline in the future? Is there anything that you can uh, sort of touch on or anything secret squirrel that that can, you can maybe shed a little bit of light on? Yeah, we, uh, we don't have anything that I can shed light on, but I can tell you that we do have a lot in the pipeline. So next year is gonna be a very big year for us. This year was our 35th anniversary. Um, next year is gonna be even bigger. So it's gonna be a really exciting year. We've got lots of new products, lots of new directions. Um, we're all about innovation. So um, you'll see some brand new stuff over the next 12 months. We're really excited. Oh, okay, so the question that I'm going to ask everyone is choose your child. Which one is your favourite? If you had to take one home today that was going to be all yours, which one would it be? I mean, it's got to be the one right behind me. The GWG1000 is your quintessential uh, G-Shock. It is like the Mudmaster. It's what everyone associates when they think of G-Shock is that K-shape. Um, that's the big boy. That's the one we love. So, Is that one of your biggest sellers? Definitely, yeah. Well, I, uh, I worked at Commonwealth Games and I got a bit of cash up and I bought my own G-Shock. Yes, yeah, and I, I tell you what, it's the best watch I've ever owned in my life. So, uh, and I don't doubt that it's going to last me years to come. So, thank you very much for your time, mate. Thank Absolute you. pleasure to meet you and have a great time here. We're here at the Greg Ghost stall with Greg. So, how are you, mate? Not too bad. So, can you just give us a little bit of background on the company, where you've come from? Uh, so, yeah, Tactical Tailor in the States uh, started the company, uh, American company, American made. And uh, we wanted to get the price down so that the end user could have an affordable piece of kit. So, we started up Greg Ghost. And uh, I, we brought it up into Canada just to help um, in the Canadian side and help with the international sales. Yeah, awesome. How long have you been operating for? Um, I've been in the military for about 12 years and I'm getting out and I'm starting with the company in the last 30 days, last month. So that's going to be your transition? Yeah, excellent, nice. It's going to work out just nicely for you. Get to play with some, uh, keep playing with gear. Exactly, I get to help design it and uh, I, I know all the guys still so it's easy for me to get it to them and uh, I've tried it, used it. I've used all their stuff overseas on Afghanistan and stuff so um, I back the company and they back me so it's great. Do you guys have any uh, products that you're launching here today? Uh, no, just because we haven't been in Australia, we just brought what we had going so far. So uh, we are innovating new stuff, but we're going to put that in SHOT Show in Vegas in uh, January. So In January? That's going to be the big launch, it's in January. What's the future? Have you got anything in the pipeline? Anything that you can, uh, you can leak a little bit for us? Uh, if you've got anything new coming out? We just got our level four plate certified, so that's coming out in the works. And then uh, we're designing some more uh, kit for the Canadian Forces, so we'll see how that comes out. 
And then uh, Gregos Precision is down in the States, and so we're hopefully they're going to bring them up into Canada. And uh, we do custom Glock slides with them, uh, rifles, and just weapon parts. So, Awesome. So, uh, to choose a child, which one's your favorite? Which one would you like to take home with you if you had the choice? Uh, for me, uh, like the Minimus plate, we wanted something that was more cost effective. Uh, so that's the new brainchild that's came out. Uh, but I love the gunfighter belt, the UGF belt. Uh, so it's two layers of molly, nice and compact. Uh, it's got an inner for your belt, and then the outer Velcro's on top of it. And uh, for three gun and uh, ranges and stuff like that, it's perfect. So, And then we got the nice big thick buckle on there so it doesn't fall off. Yeah, excellent, nice. Tough, built to last. Exactly, yeah. Yep. So where best can we find you? What platforms are you on? Uh, we're just getting into Australia now with Tactile Gear. So if you get a hold of Wes Bruce and get on the website, uh, once he gets all this stuff in Australia, we're going to do a 25% off sale. So it's best place to get What kind of timeline are we looking at? Uh, hopefully in the next couple of weeks. Oh, that close. Yeah, nice. Awesome. Thank you very much for your time, mate. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much for your service as well. And uh, we wish you all the best in the future. Thanks. Have a good one.